Now let us understand the concept of bend deduction and what is the difference between bend deduction and bend allowance and what is the relation between them. So here is an example of a bent part and the bend angle and the flange angle is both 90 degrees and C and D indicate the total leg lengths. OSSB is given as shown over here. OSSB is the same for both the sides. X and Y indicate the leg length 1 and leg length 2. Now the blank length for this kind of a bend let us consider that as L. So the total blank length required to make this bend is equal to L and that will be equal to total length of the blank will be equal to X which is this leg length plus bend allowance which is this arc length in red color plus Y which is the leg length 2. So X plus bend allowance plus Y will give us the total blank length in the unfolded view of this a 90 degree bent sheet metal part. So L blank length is equal to X plus BA, BA indicates bend allowance plus Y. Let, let us consider this as equation number 1. So this is the blank length as a function of X, BA and Y. Now if you are finding the blank length as a function of C and D which is the total leg length as shown over here. So between C and D there will be an overlap. As you can see over here, this is the unfolded view of the part. So C and D will have an overlap and that overlap is shown over here as P. So this overlap is P and if we are calculating that, then the total blank length is equal to L is equal to X plus OSSB minus P, which is from this point to this point. So X plus OSSB is C minus P from this point to this point plus P which is this length plus Y plus OSSB minus P. Y plus OSSB, Y plus OSSB is equal to D minus P is distance from this point to this point. So from this point to this point is X plus OSSB minus P. From this point to this point is nothing but P. And from this point to this point it is Y plus OSSB minus P. Simplifying we get that L is equal to X plus Y plus 2 into OSSB minus P. Let us consider this as equation number 2. So there are two equations which have been derived. The first equation is blank length as a function of bend allowance and second one blank length as a function of OSSB and P which is the overlap between the two leg lengths as shown over here. Now comparing these two equations we can see that BA is equal to 2 into OSSB minus P because in both the cases L should be the same hence comparing equation number 1 to equation number 2 we get that 2 into OSSB minus P is equal to BA and that P is nothing but bend deduction. So it is called as bend deduction and bend deduction is given by this formula. Bend deduction is equal to BA plus 2 into OSSB or bend allowance is equal to 2 into OSSB minus BD which is bend deduction. So these three are the important parameters which are required to be specified for a design, for manufacturing and drawing preparation. So OSSB, outside setback, bend deduction and bend allowance.